Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to insert table on MailChimp. So the first thing that you would like to do, of course, is just go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually using Brave, but of course, in your case, you can use any other browser could be possibly working for you. Once you open that browser, make sure to go to this URL section and simply type mailchimp.com and hit the enter button. And that should take you into this page, which is going to be your home screen or your main screen. Of course, if you have an account, you can simply go and click at login into your account. So you can actually enter your name or user's name or email, then password. Then you can log in into your account. If you don't have an account, you can actually scroll down here and see all the plans that they have. They have the three paid plans and one pre plan. Once you choose whatever plan suits you, let's use this as an example. They're going to get you to the section where you can actually create your account. As you can see, let's just click add to this free plan, sign up for free or sign up free. And that should take you here. Simply just enter your email, username and password, then click on sign up. Let me do that and I'm coming back. So now you have to check your email by just going to your email and activate it by the message that they're going to send you. Once you activated your account, you'll find yourself here again. So let's just click at continue free. Here, you'll have just to enter your first name, last name. So let's just enter those. That is uh, like suggested for me and click on next. Of course, the phone number is just optional. And here, of course, you'll have to enter your address, thanks and etc. So let's just enter those, click on next. And here, of course, you'll have to answer some questions. If you don't want to, it's cool. You can just keep pressing, pressing and at next, as you can see. But the first one, you should actually just answer it and you will see the rest of them. You can actually cl keep clicking at skip. Once you finish, click on finish. And as you can see, once you click on let's go, you will find yourself on the home screen of the MailChimp website. So as we said in the beginning of this tutorial, we would like to insert a table. So of course, on this content section on this list panel, You can just go and click on my files and if you have some designs here, you can start editing on them. If you don't, like me, I don't have, you can just go and click uh, one of your campaigns and start editing one of your campaigns, then go to the design of your campaign. So here we are, let's just edit this design of this campaign or the theme. And of course, let's just go and wait for this, this campaign builder. Okay. And here, let's just drop a text block as an example. Here, let's just delete this. And of course, simply you can just go here to this merge tags and scroll down a bit and until you find this contents helper and make sure to choose table of continents, then simply go and save and close. Of course, all done, you've successfully added a table of content to your campaigns. To see how your campaign will appear in your recipient's inbox, you will have to look at it in the preview mode. So let's just quit this, uh, exit anyway, let's just wait. And now we can go in this preview mode and here you'll find your table of continents. For me, I didn't add any text or any hidden or something like that. That's why nothing appears here. But for you, if you have them and you add this table of continents, you'll find them right there. So that's actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye.